I'm going to be doing my best to avoid spoilers uh, for the third one, so I will go in completely blind. Sup, Professor Duart? Hey, good to see you. Uh, about to start the trailer now, so what's sup with you? <clears throat> oh, I need water, hang on. I want to wait for the world to load so that it doesn't slow me down when I'm in the middle of the video. It'll take just a second. Okay. I had an idea for a an additional cartographer home. And I want to build the interior. Um, I'll leave it empty for now, unpopulated with uh, cartographers, uh, until the experimental villager changes come out, and then I'll want to have uh, swamp villagers with maps to other villages in other biomes. And then I'll... Yeah. Oh dear. What just happened? <laughs> what? Okay, hopefully that's the last time. Goodness gracious, did I really hit it that many times? <clears throat> okay, anyway. <sighs> Give me a sec. There we go, that should be better. There we go, now we're getting sound. Okay. Let's watch this video. I don't remember this being here. Are you sure this is a shortcut to Minecraft Live? Absolutely. I'll prove it. Huh? This is the armadillo, one of the mobs that wants to join Minecraft. It lives in warm places, like this savanna biome. The armadillo drops skewed, which can be used to craft armor for your wolf. This will give your favorite four-legged friend some extra defense against hostile mobs. I am not lost, <laughs> but do you know the way to Minecraft Live? Do you want the armadillo to join Minecraft? Huh? 
Voting opens on October 13th at 1 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, and you'll have 48 hours to cast your vote. Cute. And what was it they said? Which can be used to craft all the armadillo drops skewed. Which the armadillo drops skewed. Which can be used to craft armor for your wolf. Can be used to craft armor for your wolf. Hmm. Very interesting. Well, we'll leave that uh, be for for now. Uh, Professor Duo says, Cartographer House should have several, little trinkets from several vastly different biomes. I do sort of have that already. Give me a second. Uh, in this one, I've got, uh, in addition to the cherry blossom pot, I have a, a dark oak sapling over here okay, and a map. Uh, but this isn't the design that was finalized. It's pretty close. It has three action animations that I could, can see that could or could not be in the game. Interesting, interesting. I'll take note of those when we get into the uh, further analysis. Uh, you can see I also made the, these banners here. Um, I... I could put up item frames with trinkets from around the world in the copy of this one, but I had a different plan for uh, this one here. I wanted this one to be uh, the nether portal room for the village. Not including rolling up or unrolling. Mm. I really hope the seeing you and screeching is in the game, because that is hilarious. <laughs> yes, that sounds like it would be absolutely phenomenal. Oh, give me a second. Okay. Let's see. I want to make... Or maybe... Hyphy would actually work here. They sniff the ground and shake their head as well. Cute. Gotta remember, though, it's not necessarily... Hmm, interesting. It's not necessarily going to be like that in-game. Keyword, possible animations. Yep.
a dye, cyan dye, and glow ink. You need the exclamation mark because the hanging sign looks better. This one literally won't fit all of the word destination on it. And let's see. Right here. Very nice. And the same be said for this one. Hmm. Let me put on some music, actually. All right, is that an okay volume? Okay, good. Yeah, that looks okay. Maybe if... Should be able to reach their cartography tables from there.
Okay. Oh, and... <clears throat> it should have... I was trying to think of a way that I could... Satisfactory... Power... That... And then use a button to unpower it. Hmm... If this is a, a full block here, that'll work. Or, it won't work if it's like that. Mm. That'll do. I don't have these over here at all, do I? No. I do have those for the cleric. Alright, I'll, I'll just use the warped fungus for it instead. You're not a cleric, so you don't get that. Pressure plate wouldn't work because I'd immediately be stepping off of it. Yes. Oh, I missed that message. That, uh, that yes. What was that yes in response to? I'm sorry. I was hyper focusing. Red roots. You're right, crimson roots. Bam. I don't have anything using that. Perfect, and that looks cool. 
actually, hmm, sound. S oh, the sound was good. Right, right. Now I can just press the button and go in, and then open it up and go out. Why would I need to press the button to go in when I can just open it and close it? Well, that's 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 easy. That's because I can hit the button and then go in, and then it closes itself automatically. Yeah. This is cool. And it'll give me a chance to uh, work on some map art, too. It's... I plan on having uh, a Crimson Forest, a Warped Forest, uh, a Soul Sand Valley, and the Nether Wastes uh, in little picture frames on the map art. Um, and that's funny because when you go through the portal, it's going to be Basalt Delta. If I recall correctly. So they'll have advertised all of these amazing places, and then you go through, and it's the worst possible biome that you could find in the nether. <laughs> I just thought that would be hilarious. As for this, though. have to be slabs. Chop rows could work for that one, though. So, let's do that. Presto. Maybe... Yeah, that's that's interesting. Or maybe maybe more like this. Not that. Yeah, this is probably better. That's cool. I like that. should prevent any zombie pigmen from coming in. Yay! Trapdoors look better underneath. I thought so, too. Right, I forgot about that. looks more like quartz than it did before with the old texture, but I used the old texture to make the flower of a lily pad. I'll have to show that off sometime. I haven't been building with uh, item frame, uh, or not item frame, um, armor stand tricks. Just because it's so difficult to set up. And you also can't do it in survival. You need more touristy garbage. Oh, 
more touristy garbage. What do you think? Touristy garbage? Knick-knacky enough? Something unique and flashy that anyone who had been in the nether would think was valuable, but isn't. Hmm. Well, the gilded blackstone kind of fits that description. Ah! The gilded blackstone kind of fits that description. Something unique and flashy. Unique to the nether. And flashy. Someone who had not been in the nether. Mm and flashy, huh? What about blaze powder? Ooh, and glowstone dust. Glowstone dust, there we go. Blaze powder. Blaze powder is kind of valuable, but... Not really on its own. Like when tourists seek something foreign must be super expensive so vendors charge more because they can get away with it. Exactly. Blaze powder is not very useful on its own. It's it, it's valuable, but only for someone who knows what it does. And you can get a lot. And glowstone dust in particular. That really fits that description. So yeah, that, that works out perfectly. Kitschy stuff. No, that's good. <laughs> or a light-weighted pressure plate. Never mind, I don't like how that looks. Perfect. It's so really only supposed to go up to three high, but the interior of the building allows for more space in most cases. So, I'll leave it as is. I might need to swap it around if I have the, uh, the pot up there on top. But it should fit on the other side, I think. Yeah.
Just to be certain that they will actually refresh the trades and they won't spawn outside of the area that they're supposed to be in. I will uh, create a wall here. Uh, remove this one so that they don't accidentally bond to that one. Uh, villager put you in there to see what you do. Okay. And let's empty out one of your trades real quick. Perfect. There we go. 12 maps. I don't need those maps, but I need to know whether you will refresh your trades. Bum, 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 ba -da 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 in fact, time set night. Let's make sure that you sleep all right. Um, let's get rid of that bed. You see this bed is yours, right? You can reach it. Carpet? Is that stopping you? Uh, did you... Did you want one of those? You're getting rid of those? Let you go to bed? No, I bet I know what it is. I bet they need a certain amount of space above the bed in order to perceive, perceive it as a bed. No, where, where, where are you going? Okay. Okay, time set day. Time set night. What are you doing? I'm not gonna get up there. I think it might not be registering this bed. between one and five. There we go. You found that bed right away. Okay. Time set day. All right. You're a cartographer now. Cool. Follow up question. If the glass is down here, will you find your way into bed? No, nope, yep, that's still good enough for you. Okay, 
what happens if I break it? Replace it. I'm set night. Still good enough for you? Mm, yeah, okay. Now. I'm set day. Okay, cool. And I'll break it and replace it. Time set night. Can you find that bed now? It doesn't look like it. But let's say there's space above the bed. Can you find it now? I like that, huh? Okay, what about now? Yep, that, that's when you get in the bed. Make sure he cannot exit the bed elsewhere. That should be the case. I tested it uh, myself. And I did not exit the bed elsewhere. Should consistently go onto that block. I'm set night. Now, I'm set day. Yep. Okay. So that will work, but it won't stop them from leaving. Putting a trap door there wouldn't work because they consider that as a block. breaks of that, but could an item frame be kept there? No. And if I place a block there, it'll pop off. Right? Yeah. Okay. So that won't be able to stop them. That's dark oak. Didn't mean to use dark oak, but that's fine. Okay, now let's say... Boop, there we go. That connects. Not bad. Looks pretty cool. And it should stop them from leaving. But I can get through no problem. Formulated any thoughts on the armadillo? <sighs> I don't know.
Well, that's certainly an interesting way of writing. That's very stupid. <laughs> yeah. Don't try the double sign, have the whole first half of the sentence on one. But picturesque doesn't fit on a hanging sign at all. <laughs> 